Dearly beloved, my loving greetings to you in the name of Jesus. We have entered into the last day of this month. God has protected us all through this month, held our hands and guided us to be a blessing. How many counsels He gave us, how many promises He gave us, He led us through. We have praised God, thinking of His love for us. Now we are in the prayer walk garden at the prayer mount. I am talking with you from here. Here it contains prayer points for various districts and their details and the details of states by which you can nicely pray using the prayer points kept here. If you start praying like that, you can, you can pray for hours. The prayer will be certainly meaningful and, and a blessed one for you. You can also come and I urge you lovingly to come and pray here. Now what does God want to tell us on this last day? In Joel chapter 2 and verse 26, You shall eat in plenty and be satisfied and praise the name of the Lord your God who has dealt wondrously with you. Here God says, You will praise me thinking, thinking of the way I led you wondrously. Blessed you to be satisfied. What a, what a wonderful God He is. If you think about this month, he has beautifully led you through. I will bless you to be satisfied. Was there any lack? Just think, no means to eat, brother. We suffered a lot. We were put to shame because such and such needs were not met. Did you suffer from any of this? God has blessed you to be satisfied. All through this month, He has, he has led you wondrously and and we have to praise God thinking about that. It says that we must joyfully praise God. If we praise God with a thankful heart, being thoughtful of the goodness God granted us, God will give us more goodness next. Because God will not forget those who are with a grateful heart. So will you praise God saying, You led me wondrously today and all through this month. Blessed me to be satisfied. You did not let me be ashamed. I joyfully rejoice and praise your name. Shall we give thanks to God thinking of thinking of all the blessings He gave us throughout this month? Shall we praise Him? Dear Father, thank you for leading us wondrously from the first day of this month until now. Thank you. Thank you for blessing me to be satisfied. Thank you for you spoke with me and encouraged me. Thank you for your guidance when I was anxious. Thank you for giving your promises and strengthening me. Thank you. Thank you for answering me and blessing me whenever I called out to you. You blessed me to be satisfied and be thoroughly happy. I thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you wholeheartedly. I praise you wholeheartedly for all the blessings, God. I offer you sacrifices of thanks. How good you are, dear Lord. How wonderful you are. You are the God who is loving and compassionate on me. You are the one who guides me holding my hand, dear Lord. I offer my sacrifices of thanks wholeheartedly and joyfully, dear Father. Amen. Amen.